the top of Black Canyon, just outside of Heber. That is a wonderful view. When we first moved to Heber, we didn't realize there was so much to it. It had just been a pass-through place for us, but now it's a place where we call home. And as you can see, the views around here are amazing. canyon about way back in the St. Reeves National Forest. Looks like we found a little rock shelter here. Of course we'll leave everything in place but it's pretty neat. What do you guys think? What are you seeing over there? Uh, some black. Well we found some charcoal. Found some charcoal? Yeah. yeah and some beans. Some beans? Yeah. Oh wow really? Yep. Well that'd be interesting. We'll take a look at that here in just a second but you can see the cliffs are just absolutely beautiful here um so we're gonna look around for some petroglyphs here's Corey right here sitting next to what is that that just looks like an area of rock layer laid down by water yeah. that you find all over the earth what do you think it's really high up all right so they're looking around in the floor of this cave right here i'll show you again the view from here now it looks like what happened is whoever was up here they ended up building this up with rocks and uh i don't know if there was somebody that was hiding here but they definitely had food here right caleb what yeah. you got got some beans i don't know what kind of beans those are yeah i don't know they're definitely hold um there's a nice dry area right there that's flat this would make an excellent camping spot by the way so anyway it's just beautiful right underneath the shelter here if we had a big snowstorm come in, we'd be dry and without snow, but uh, we would also not be able to hike back. All right, Corey was over here looking underneath this part of the cliff, and she found a couple of things she wants to point out to you. So there's a piece of pottery right here. Whoa! It's got the dragon scales that they put on it. Oh, yeah, it's the pinch pottery. Oh, there's a bone. That oh, definitely this. came this from something really that they ate. And so... This yeah. may have been where they put, uh, I don't trash. know, some of their trash. It kind of looks like it, a little trash midden type place. But uh, we're not going to do any digging. We're going to leave everything where we found it uh, for the next people to come. Another place that looks like it was inhabited. I'm going to show you what Caleb found over here. What you got? Oh, nice. Yeah. Probably Mogollon culture. I don't know. Somebody could tell us that knows better. But uh, we've got bone over here too. Oh, yep, a bone. So people eating squirrels and rabbits and whatnot up here. So it does smell like a skunk has been up here. It smells just like Portland. So anyway, what do you think so far, Christian? Uh, it's quite a hike to get here. It is, it is. Not too many people have been up here, I imagine. Uh, probably not. Okay, we went ahead and climbed to the top of the canyon wall. It is way down there, but I wanted to show you what it looked like further down the canyon. And here's straight down. Beautiful, beautiful. Before the big storm, the snowstorm comes. <laughs> 